Right now, and as students return to school, you may see them struggling to remember some of the old material or even focus on some new lessons. But experts say there are some goals that you can set aside for your kids to help with learning loss. Let's check in now at 7 News' Christine Scarpelli. She's live in Spartanburg at the Sylvan Learning Center with some help. Good morning. Yeah, we talk about goals so far, starting off with some goals, especially after I know we talk about the summer slide, but there's also a period over winter break where we're almost telling ourselves to forget and to relax and to rest. Um, coming back from break, is there a way you need to go about you know, finding out what you've forgotten or what you've missed or what you maybe didn't know in the first place, right. didn't quite catch the first time around? How do you go about assessing that? Okay, so um, yes, there is some forgetting that happens over winter break, but very often there's more likely skill gaps. Um, uh, for example, a child who's in pre-algebra may not be successful in pre-algebra because they never really learned fractions in fifth grade. That's or, years ago. Yes, and so if you have a child that's struggling and not meeting your goals, you may need to have them assess to really determine what skills they they have and what skills they don't have. And of course, we do that here at Sylvan. We do a lot of consulting with our families to find out what's really the cause for the child not meeting your goals, whether it's grades or, or specific skills. And you would think that would happen in the classroom as well, you know, in school, but communication with a teacher is probably yes. key here. Communication with the teacher is key. Understanding how to read a child's MAP scores or iReady scores, um, which the schools do three times a year. But if you're not sure what those mean, you, you may need to reach out to your teacher and say, can you explain this to me um, so that I know what to expect from my child and what's attainable. Very good. You provide a little bit of help, even if it's just tutoring, a little bit of after school assistance. Tell everybody how they can best get a hold of you. Yes. Best way to get a hold of us is 1-800-EDUCATE and um, we have program advisors standing by to help you and they will um, forward you to the Spartanburg Center if need be. So. And Joanne Russell hopefully because she is a huge <laughs> help and will definitely help you over the phone. We've got a link to their website, wspa.com, easy to find right here in Spartanburg. Send it back to you guys.